We know how important, even difficult it is to keep up with tech as things get more advanced and change the way we live. That's especially true when it comes to robots, as we've already seen them do things like delivering food and providing security and even therapy. And today's Technically Speaking, though, uh, Local 10's Gina Insignaris explains how a local institution is helping people keep up with changing times by providing real-world experience in robotics and artificial intelligence. The Allen B. LeVan NSU Broward Center of Innovation is 54,000 square feet of space, dubbed the world's first theme park for entrepreneurs. This is truly emerging technology. This is the future here now. John Wensveen, the executive director of the LeVan Center and chief innovation officer at NSU, hopes that moniker sticks and represents an ecosystem built around innovation, technology, and entrepreneurship. Part of that was to bring in robotics, and robots are the future. It's going to transform the way that humans live and work and play. That transformation comes with some help from Robot Lab, a robotics company focused on helping schools and businesses learn about and integrate robots into their work. Since the Levan Center's opening in April of 2022 and the following partnership with Robot Lab in September of that year, this learning space has grown significantly. Coding and programming are among the skills taught here, as is showing how robots are going to be used in the future. A variety of hands-on stations are scattered across the lab meant to provide real-world experience, including mock setups and a variety of robots that can mimic scenarios beyond typical use. These are miniature simulated environments that we can create that can be applied in real life applications and our goal here is to truly identify what kind of global trends and challenges exist out there so that we can come up with strategies based on the opportunities that we're finding to apply robotics in those environments. The job, according to Wensveen, is to build a toolbox. And robots are one piece of that toolbox. From there, it's up to someone to figure out how to use it within their own environment. We have one rule here, and the rule is that there are no rules. And the moment that you put parameters around how you do, how you think, then you're not innovative. It allows everybody from students to entrepreneurs to industry government partners to truly play in this big sandbox and see what works and what doesn't so that when we do go to the real world, it will be functional. Dante Mede is an example of a student who's getting the opportunity to benefit directly from this Levan Center Robot Lab partnership through an internship. He's a coder on the robotics team at NSU University School. This place, it's got robots that I've never seen before. These are robots that are like very cool and it's very difficult to get your hands on. So this center allows you to like touch base with these robots that you wouldn't have been able to otherwise. Some of Mede's early work involved coding robots to play soccer. The only limit in this field, he says, is your imagination and physics. It's just so interesting to be able to get to see like, oh, it wasn't something before, now it is. We had, we, we were going from like a shell of a walking robot to a fully functioning soccer program. Being able to say like, this is where we started and this is where we are now and seeing that progression over time. This relationship between the Levan Center and Robot Lab is something the director and founder of the company, Elad Inbar, tells us is incredibly rewarding. It's all part of a mission toward making robots and this technology accessible, inclusive, and engaging. This is the future, and it's important to prepare these kids that will, you know, graduate in the 2030s. Kids that are in, you know, middle school, high school today. We know the world will be different, um, you know, at that point. So, you know, get them uh, all the training that, uh, you know, we can provide them, so they will be, uh, you know, valuable in the workplace and, and everything when they graduate. An insistence on that repeated phrase: the future. It's happening right now, and this collaborative effort is seen by all as worth it. Coding is the future, robots are the future. And when you learn it, you're becoming part of that future. And I think it's very important for people to learn, at least to some degree, so that they can be part of the like next generation of robots. Robot Lab hopes to have Robot Lab teams in every major metro area, creating a network of support across schools, universities, and businesses. They tell us there's already one team in Fort Lauderdale. As for the Levan Center, they say the goal is to create more education and awareness about their work and help bring entrepreneurs across South Florida together. Technically speaking, I'm Gio Insignores, Local 10 News.